and we'll look at a couple of more applications of percentage problems. In this case we're told that Jake modified his airplane so that it could carry an additional 220 pounds. If this was an 18 percent increase in the aircraft's payload, what was the original payload amount? Well I'll solve this one by setting up a percent proportion. The amount, the base, and the rate. In this case the amount is the additional 220 pounds. The base is what we don't know. We don't know the original total, but we do know the rate. We're told it was an 18 percent increase. So I'll say A over B equals R over 100. And I'll put those numbers in. A is 220 divided by B, that's going to equal 18 over 100. Then to solve for B, I'm going to multiply 220 times 100 and divide by 18. So B is 220 times 100 divided by 18. And I'll uh, pull out a calculator and do that. 220 times 100 divided by 18 comes out to be 1,222 pounds. That was the original payload before he made the modifications. Okay, this one involves some traffic engineering, which is really a pretty important field, kind of a subset of civil engineering. We're told here that at a certain intersection there were 36 automobile accidents in 2006. In the year 2007, the next year, there were 51. What was the rate of increase in accidents? So we can calculate this pretty easily. First I'm going to do 51 minus 36 and that gives me 15. So there were 15 more accidents in 2007. So instead of 36 accidents there were 15 more than that. So I'm comparing 15, the increase, to the 36, the original amount. And I'll do that calculation. 15 divided by 36 comes out to 0.416 repeating and that's um, going to be about 41.6 percent and I would just write that as approximately 42 percent. 15 is 42 percent of the original 36 and this is the kind of number that a traffic engineer or someone working in the city would want to know. If, there, if at a particular intersection there was a 42% increase in traffic accidents one year, you want to investigate that and figure out why. Did something change about the traffic patterns or the way the road, some, some repairs maybe need to be made to the road or something's messed up with the stoplights? But that's a significant number and you want to be aware of that sort of thing so that you can address the problem.